So in this video, I'm going to check out the accuracy of heart rate and blood oxygen sensor on Samsung Galaxy Fit 3. Also, I'll be comparing it with Galaxy Watch 6 just to see if there is any massive difference or not. On Galaxy Fit 3, we have this continuous heart rate measurement option where the band takes a reading every second. You can also change it by going into Samsung Health app. Now scroll down and tap on settings. Choose heart rate and now tap on your desired option. Since it's a fitness band, I'll suggest to use this continuous option. Anyways, now let's test out the heart rate sensor. You can simply swipe on tiles and this is a heart rate tile. You can also tap it to see more information. So this is a reading on my Galaxy Fit 3. Now let's see on my Galaxy Watch 6. Now I'll be checking out the heart rate tile that is right here. By the way with Galaxy Watch 6, Samsung is using an infrared sensor to check out your heart rate versus green light that can be seen on Galaxy Fit 3. This is because green light is a bit distracting when you are taking a nap. But this infrared sensor is definitely slow than the green light sensor on Galaxy Fit 3. As you can see both of them are kinda close when it comes to heart rate. Now let's compare them with an Omron BP apparatus. Once again you can see that heart rate sensor is kinda good on both of them. But I'll give Galaxy Fit 3 a thumbs up for a bit faster reading. Now let's test out the blood oxygen sensor on both of them. The speed was kinda same on both of them and here are the results. So it's about the same on Galaxy Fit 3 and Galaxy Watch 6. Now let's compare this with a medical grade pulse oximeter. And these are the results. We have kinda close readings on all of these devices. I will add 3 different readings here. You can pause the video and check it out. Both of them don't offer continuous blood oxygen measurement. So Galaxy Fit 3 offers a great heart rate and blood oxygen sensor. You can definitely use this smart band during work hours and for sleep tracking. Make sure to subscribe as I'll be posting more Galaxy Fit 3 content. And with that being said, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, bye bye.